Okay, it says Sarah used 2.5 cups of cheese in a dish that serves 10 people. Aaron used 1.6 cups of cheese in a dish that serves 8 people. How much more cheese in one serving of Sarah? Now, servings talk about how much I'm using per person. So, I'm going to go 2.5 cups divided by 10. Now, I really hope you guys can divide by 10 right in your nougat and not show any work. Dividing by 10 means doing what to my decimal point? Moving it over, and how many spots? One to the left. It's going to the left because it gets smaller. 2.5 divided by 10 means 0.25 cups per person. I'm writing it left to right like this because my next one's going to fit in there very nicely. Now I have 1.6 cups for 8 people. So now I've got to show a little work off to the side just to make sure I line up my decimal point correctly. 1.6 divided by 8. Eight's on bottom, goes outside the house, put in my point two. Now I'm getting point two cups per person. Now, here's the part that's gonna mess a couple people up. If it says how much more cheese, what kind of math do I have to do to calculate the difference between point two five and point two? Subtraction. And notice when I said to calculate the difference. Difference means subtract. Now, I can't subtract these though. Who can raise their hand and tell me what needs to magically be put in here? Zero. Uh, Austin? Put in a zero because they got to be the same length. And make sure I line up my decimal point. This becomes five. This becomes point zero five cups per person. Now, anytime they give us multiple choice, you betcha. They're always going to give me the answer that screws up and is off by a decimal point. So now, my answer is D. 0.05 cups. 